Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Just excuse me a minute while I... Ah, that's better. Now, I've already done a small piece because it decided it wasn't going to record for me. So, I'll fill in with what, I, what I'm doing. I'm doing the Z is for Zoo Babies. Now, I looked at, at all various websites and they were all doing like... Welcome new one, welcome little baby, or congratulations. I thought, no, nah, don't want to do that. I want to be different. So what I'm doing, I'm using the sentiments from the Wild by Flowers, but you could use any sentiment, really. And I'm going to put, do the congratulations on your new adventure. I mean, you could you could use any card, uh, any sentiments. What I did just before I started, I stamped the congratulations on your new adventure in Old Olive. So I've already done that. You missed it, I'm sorry. So what I've done at the moment, I'm just going to do a little bit more, is I've stamped some animals on here. I know you can't see them yet, but hold your horses. Don't run away yet. Where's my little monkey gone? Oh, there he is. My little monkey. Uh, I'm using soft sea foam for this um, because it it's given me the effect I want. So now then, uh, yes, that's the soft sea foam, and it's sort of taken away the the whiteness of the card really. So now then. I am then going in to uh, Old Olive, if I can open it. The Old Olive. Where's my... No, these things just vanish in front of my face. And now, I'm going to stamp Old Olive. So you've got the, the soft sea foam at the back, just to take away some of that whiteness and now what is making that rock uh oh got ink on my fingers right like you you know you couldn't see where they were and I definitely can't see where these all these animals are so I'm just I'm putting them to one side because I shall um I will clean them before I put them away. But uh, this is the third attempt I've had at doing this card. So uh, I'm hoping that the battery won't run out. Or, I don't know, zebras flying in the air. Whatever it is. Oh, took my zebras. Here we are. We'll put a zebra in there. There we go. And I think... No, I need something up there, does it? Does it it? And the elephant's too big, so let's stick another zebra up there. Love, love his top end. I don't, I'd rather have a top end of a zebra than the bottom end, actually. But, uh, no, I'm quite happy with that. Ooh, stabs us. Right. Now then, I'm going to give my hands a wipe because I've got... Old olive ink all over them, and I know what will happen as soon as I sit down and start putting the card together. There is going to be monster attacks everywhere. Now, the, oh, another thing I do need to do is on my sentiments. I want, I want to, want to, want. I want to. No, we won't have that one. We'll have the little zebra. And the old olive. The other ones are to the soft sea foam. It's been a, a hectic day today. Um, I will go through everything and bore you, but it's only now I've had the chance to sit, well, stand and do this. Um, the gardeners came, my groceries came. The um, I bought an oven grill from Marketplace that came, and of course, all of these make a noise. So, there we go, we'll have a zebra that side, 
and then to fit no it doesn't fit we put the toucan if the toucan you can uh yes what else there was something else as well that that sort of stopped me in my tracks today so i thought well never mind i'll do it now this afternoon near the evening there we go put the toucan on one side it looks darker doesn't it and i washed the stamp Oh, I know why I put in two front olive. <laughs> oh dear, time for me to go and put my feet up, I think. <laughs> right, put these away before I get covered in them myself. <laughs> Look, dirty fingers. Ugh. Right, now then, we can start putting the, turn it over that way because the other side are dirty bits on. Right, so what I'm doing here, I'm using... A uh, piece of A4, uh, and I cut it in half long ways, score it, don't forget, lump in the middle, and fo fold it over. And then where's that just, oh dear me, I'm losing everything today. Now then, I'm going to put this on first. So I hope you've had a calm day, or a better day than I have, and uh, you've been able to get on and do your bit of crafting. Because uh, it's a wonderful thing, because you get lost in it, don't you? You know, time flies then. Oh, did I get it up? Shh, Wendy. I did that earlier and I got a big, big splodge of ink on it. And just to confuse the matter, I'm going to use this. That way on. I don't know about you, but since this haircut, our, our lockdown haircut, everybody's hair has got haywire. It really has. It's, it's probably thought, right, that's it. I know I can grow that long. So now I'm going to keep growing. I'm going to grow as fast as I can. That's what it must be saying to itself, I think. Right, now we'll put this sentiment. I didn't want to put black uh, lettering. Um, it's We always do, don't we? We always think, oh, well, black for letters. But uh, I thought, no, I wanted to keep this sort of a, a safari-looking um, card. Push it over a little bit so that it comes to that corner. Come on, push, 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 push. There we go. And there we are. Congratulations on your new adventure. I hope you give it a go. And it's been really lovely doing this series with you all the way through the alphabet apart from the letter X. But, however, if Stampin' Up! do come out with the letter X, then I will be doing... Uh, the letter X just to finish off the whole series. Thank you much. Thank you very much for watching, and uh, I'll be joining you again next week for another new little surprise one. See you soon. Bye.